All right. It's a re-recording, so sadly I don't have the original recording. Also, yeah, I've done this event before. Uh, the new Champion of Christmas, this was one that was requested. I actually asked about this one. And I, I can't believe I'm doing both of them. Both Christmas events. Krampus! <clears throat> Still after us! You know what? Please! I have to speak with them! Now's not the time! Keep running! Hurry up! Hurry up! for getting you involved in this it's okay we'll just we'll get through it somehow still it would be easier to figure out something if we at least had the app <laughs> finally gotcha did we you just don't know when to give up M Maria stay back hey wait up you're the ones who have been assaulting students from our school and robbing them of their money, are you not? Repent and apologize at once to those you have harmed. Wait, Maria, stop! We lost our phones, remember? We can't use the app. We won't be able to recover like we usually do if we get hurt. No, Ryota, we mustn't forsake those who live in sin. Uh-huh. A strong one, eh, Vass? Shouldn't, shouldn't be speaking ill of others, little darling. <clears throat> we're just show, we're just showing you where you sit on the social ladder. You're not so high and mighty as to be walking around showing off your riches. As if that were the issue. Whoa there, lass! Right tough one, ain't ya? Think you can fight even without your app, huh? Ah, release me! Maria! No! Let go of her! That is not my Ryota voice, but I... <laughs> ah, looks like we've got to put this one in his place, too! Shiro, Kingo, Brandon, help! Well, that sound. Bells? Beginning to feel a lot like Christmas. Oi, tis getting closer, huh? Shiver me timbers, tis cold! T -t -t something be here! Wait, something be here? What? Who the Davy Jones lock are ye? Are these ye mateys? Came to help, came to help, did ye? Hmm. Have you been naughty? Hey! Don't go answering me question with a question. Now answer me question! Hmm. Naughty indeed. Uh, have we met? And uh, what do you mean, naughty? Yes, it's subtle. Folks who harass those who can't fight back or who harm others are certainly naughty children. <laughs> At the very least. 
positively not good little children. So just what are you gonna do? What will I do? Isn't it obvious? Christmas time is here, and judgment time too. Every child is judged by the saints and determined to be naughty or nice. Nice children are rewarded with generous blessings. Naughty ones must face reprimand from the saints, from one of the saints' attendants, as well as receive a strict, merciless punishment. My job, on behalf of the saint, is to dole out suitable punishment to the naughty ones. So, for you, naughty, naughty children. It's time for a spanking! So, so, so spanking? <laughs> Are you ready, you snotty little brats? Don't think you're getting away with a simple little love tap from my coal sack either. I'll send you on a one. <laughs> I'll send you on a sleigh ride straight to hell with a baptism from a. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> I'll send you on a sleigh ride straight to hell with a baptismal swipe from these cloths! <laughs> what be with this weirdo? He just went all crazy! Uh, those press on talons? Who the hell is this freak? This horse tanker! There's no escape! Take this! Toll at the will of the bell! <laughs> Cut it out! Don't you come no closer! Huh? What's going on? Did he come to help us? Delta, are you alright? Look at Asterion being. <laughs> what do you think of my claws? Do you quake? Do you quiver? Do you shout and cry out in fear? If so, promise me something. Children, promise me you'll abandon your evil ways. I will definitely not do nothing bad again. Forgive us, please. Mercy, stole your claws. Jolly, you understand. Scatter, return home immediately. Go. Right. S sorry. So long. So long. Farewell. And to all, good night. for helping us. Words cannot express our gratitude. Hmm. No need to thank me. I'm just doing my job. Anyway, these are yours, right? Seems like they stole them from you. Hey, our phones. Th thanks. Uh, um, at the very least, may we have your name? I'm nobody worth mentioning. Be careful going home. A splendid individual. I wish he had told us his name before leaving, though. Don't you think so, Ryota? So, what ails you, Ryota? This quivering. Are you injured? So awesome! Pardon? Wasn't he awesome? No words necessary. Just totally gave those thugs what for? So awesome. I wonder where he's from. He even seemed kind of like a Santa. <laughs> oh. oh boy. Here we go. <laughs> and that's what happened. Awesome, right? Oh, you got lucky, Ryota. You would have been in serious trouble had that stranger hadn't shown up. Yeah, I was totally in hot water. I didn't have my phone either, so I couldn't even use my sacred artifact. Um, I'm glad you're safe, Ryota. But honestly, I can't count how many times I've told you not to approach Kabukicho late in the evening. 
Sorry, sorry, it was super late, so I was just gonna walk Maria back to school. Back to the school in Aoyama. We should have taken the subway instead of walking. What were you doing with Maria so late at night? Isn't Shinjuku Academy pretty far out of her way? <laughs> the truth is, Maria and I are on the executive committee for the Santa Claus departure ceremony. We had a meeting at Shinjuku Academy yesterday, so she came all the way here. Uh, um, Santa Claus departure ceremony? Oh, that's right, you don't know. Go ahead, class rep, tell him all about it. And Shiro's just like, God damn it, why are you always me? <clears throat> the Santa Claus Departure Ceremony is an event held every year on the night of Christmas Eve. As the name implies, it is a ceremony held for the departure of the Santas. It's quite the grand party. The Santa School that you'll attend organizes it, and they even invite students from all sorts of middle and high schools. Students from each school put on performances and prepare food among other things. It's the festival for the whole Santa school. The festival is massive in scale, so every year other high schools take turns at serving as joint sponsors for the event. This year it's Shinjuku Academy's turn. And so is the, and so is next year. So is the year after that. So is the year after that. <laughs> Rialta is the representative for our class on the executive committee, and I will be attending as a class committee member. It's a lot of work to make sure it goes off without a hitch. There are a ton of meetings that we gotta attend. The cooking club is also in charge of preparing all the food for the party. The cooking clubs from all the schools, including ours, are making a bunch of different dishes, so we've got a lot on our plates to keep everything organized. Chertabog is also going to help us. He recently mastered making roast duck. Alright, I'm over. I'm going over to Chernabog's house. I'll see you later. Bye! <laughs> He's a real demon in the kitchen, that one. The almighty Chernabog. Anyway, we need to leave for the meeting soon, Ryota. Are you about ready? Yep, I'm totally prepared. I've got my writing tools, my notebook, snacks, and my autograph book. The snacks are understandable as you can eat them during the during a break, but why are you bringing an autograph book? Just in case I run into that super awesome hero from yesterday. There's no such thing as being too ready, you know? This way, I'll be okay even if we run into each other unexpectedly. Ah... <sighs> That idiosyncrasy of yours rears its head. I thought you'd been keeping it under control lately. Um, idiosyncrasy? Is that a bad thing? Uh, Ryoto appears to have fallen for someone. Anytime this happens, he starts acting like this. For Ryoto, falling in love is more like getting hooked on a new fad. His wide circle of friends is widely his, his wide circle of friends is likely a byproduct of this. At any rate, he's quite assertive. The reason Kingo and I as well as Moritake and all the others became <clears throat> At any rate, he's quite assertive. It's the reason Kengo and I, as well as Moritake and all the others, became acquainted with one another. Come on, Shiro, we gotta go! We'll be late! Ah, huh, right. Let's get going. You're quite the enth you're quite enthusiastic, Ryota. We'll be back after the meeting, you two. Gotcha. We'll be having stew for dinner, so don't be late. Um, hey, uh, I want to see the Santa School. Is it okay if I tag along? Yeah, definitely. It's more fun if we all go together. Come on. You won't be able to attend the meeting, though. Are you okay with having to wait outside? The three Musketeers heading to the Santa School. Hey, why don't you invite Kingo? Kingo? Kingo, uh... He wouldn't be able to come. You see, he... <coughs> hey, you! Did Takabushi come through here? 
Oh, no, did something happen? <clears throat> it's, his, it's his semester exams from the other day. He failed every subject and was assigned supplementary lessons. How do you fail every subject? Mr. Martin, nobody was gonna tutor him personally, but that lazy wretch took off in a puff of smoke. Ugh, that's original. A smoke genie fooled by a puff of smoke. Was that supposed to be funny? I'll show you funny. I want to make you into a smoked fish. If you weren't so absent minded, he wouldn't have gotten away. Uh, Mr. Jin and Mr. Triton, please wait here for a moment. Just a few more seconds. Ah! Uh, ah! Uh, 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 ah! Crap! What are you still doing here? I thought you'd be out of the dorms already! Hey! Wait! Stop right there, Takabushi! We're two active PE teachers! Don't think you can get away from us! And that explains why Kengo is not in this story. <laughs> Kengo's escape patterns are too predictable. Regardless, that's why he won't be joining us this time. Supplementary lessons, huh? That's too bad. Let's get some Christmasy let's get some Christmasy chocolates for him on the way home. Hey, you two gotta hurry. The meeting's gonna start soon. Ah, you're right. Let's get going. Okay, Santa School, here we go! God dang it, Bri. <laughs> Thinking about the uploads, I might have to start doing, might have to do a double whammy of Tokyo after school summers, just to make it in time for Christmas. We were just here. <laughs> school is fancy. This is the main school building and over there are the student dorms. They also got a party hall. <sighs> That's good to know, Ryota, but, we're, but are we going back the right way? Today's meeting isn't at the usual place. You've been there before, right? Oh, today's meeting isn't at the usual place. You've been there before, right? Yep, leave it to me. I actually come to the Santa school quite a few times. I'm lost! You said you you said you knew this place! S -s -s Shiro Oh Ryota always playing dumb I'm really really sorry How could you get us so completely lost? We're gonna be late at this rate It's okay Someone who can help us is on the on his way. Oh, there he is. I recognize those huge antlers. You over here. Oh, there you are, Ryota. Where in the world where are you going? Hey, Yule. It's been a while. Thanks so much for coming. You're a lifesaver. Now that you mention it, we haven't talked in a while. Oh, long time no see, Brandon. <laughs> you forgot our night. <laughs> you forgot our night together? Yeah. W what? What happened between us? Nope. 
Oh, and the theory that the loop, that this game is a loop stands. Please abstain from saying such confusing things to others, Brandon. But it happened. We just had. What about yesterday? Though, if you happen to know the answer, let's talk about it when we get back. When we get back, yes. Who's this? He seems so serious. Nice to meet you. I'm Shiro Motori, Ryota's classmate, as well as the class representative. What a thorough introduction! I'm Yule, a reindeer. Ryota and I went to middle school together, and now I'm an apprentice Santa here at the Santa School. I heard as much as I heard as much from Ryota. I'm a, a reindeer aiming to be a Santa, was it? Yup. I've heard a lot about you too, Ryota. You too. <coughs> Ryota's told me all sorts of stories. Oh, such as? Well, he said you're a reliable committee chairman. He also said you're too uptight and if you would just loosen up a bit. Okay, that's enough, Yule. So, could you tell us where the auditorium is? Ah, right, I apologize. We got a bit lost. Oh, you're lost? When you called earlier, you always said to come quick, so you're lost. So, you're lost? Actually, I was on my way to the auditorium. I'll show you the way, so follow me. You're the best, Yule. Let's go, you two. I'll put this aside for now, but we're going to have to have a talk later, okay? Okay! You're on the executive committee? Are you not doing Santa this year? Oh, of course I'll be helping deliver the presents, too. That's after the party, though. Wait, aren't all Santas leaving together at the departure ceremony? That's only the senior students. Novice Santas like me won't. will just do what we always do. Aw, oh, that's too bad. I really wanted to see you leap into the air. Oh, since we've been working really hard, though, I got the official Santa duties this time. Someday soon, I will become a reliable Santa just like our headmaster and take off from the ceremony with my peers. Uh, huh. Even though you already did it, you can definitely do it, Yul. <laughs> really? Thanks. Your words really encourage me. Uh oh, it's almost time. And the auditorium. It is. Come on, now. <coughs> the auditorium isn't much further. The auditorium is where the meeting is being held. Ugh, we made it on time somehow. See you after the meeting, Brandon. <clears throat> you won't be permitted inside the auditorium. What are you going to do while we're meet in the meeting? Uh, I'll wait here. Very well. Take care not to catch a cold. Alright, off we go. If it gets too cold, just come inside anyway. Master, pretty familiar little Salmon at your service. It's rare to see you by yourself, Master. If you want, I can keep you company. I need to call for you. <laughs> <laughs> it's cold, so let me in your fur. Master, in the middle of the day? And in broad daylight? No way! I'm freaking cold, man. Okay, fine. I'm only going to sit on your nap, though. Dang it! I, I, I need warmth. Hey, Master, look! Looks like an app user is heading this way. They're on the school grounds even though school's out. We should be careful.
<laughs> um. Oh, uh, whoa. Tension in the air? Just who in the world was that transient? He sure had a mean look to him. I've got a hunch he's super powerful. And what a high, what a high, what a high fall. Okay. <laughs> I've read this before and I, I <laughs> and what a high fault in sacred artifact. Hey, the meeting's finished. Where are you, Brandon? Oh, your friends are back. Well, then, looks like it's time for me to go. No, come back. They need to meet you. Too late. Sorry, were you waiting long? The meeting went longer than we thought it would. It's good to get some sunlight, but in this cold, are you okay? Are you okay? I hope you haven't caught a chill. I need to pause. I hope you haven't caught a chill. I should have shown you to the lounge inside. Sorry, Brandon. Oh, I need to go get some files for my room. Why don't we walk back with Yule to his room? We're already here, so we might as well. Don't you want to see what the Santa School dorms are like? Hmm. Oh, yeah, sure. By the way, someone strange strolled by earlier. Someone strange? Like someone who didn't have anything to do with the school? What do they look like? Black fur? Protruding horns? Covered in scars? Seems this Therian has a real aura of danger to him. I think I might know who he is. So, this Therian... You know Krampus? You know Krampus, Rialta? Krampus? I mean, I don't know his name, but... <laughs> Here's the tea. The one I'm talking about is totally... this Is this totally awesome theory and I met. You see... Maybe keep it short, okay? <laughs> okay. Huh? So that's what happened? There's no doubt about it, that's definitely Krampus from third year. An older student? Here at Santa School? I heard him say that his job was punishing naughty little children, so I thought he might have been with the police. There are two types of Santas. I'm training to be a light Santa, while he's training to be a dark Santa. We take different courses, but we share a dorm room. You don't live by yourself? At our school, we each have our own rooms. Our rooms are way too big for one person. Usually there are two little rooms. Share a room with your crew. With you. <laughs> Such a hot roommate. <laughs> wow. Such a hot roommate. Hot? <laughs> sure, you could say that, but... I see what you're trying to say. From what I've heard so far, a scary roommate might be appropriate in this situation. No, I meant hot. No, I meant hot. I meant hot. However, two of you in the same room? Surely that can get a little uncomfortable, though. Huh? No, I don't mind at all. Even though on the chart he hates me. Even though on the relationship chart he hates me. Even though he looks a bit looks a bit scary, he's pretty nice. Sure, he's quiet, but he's a good he's a very good person. Because the way he looks and his RDF, uh, that is resting demon face. <laughs> ah! Oh, oh, I wouldn't be laughing if I didn't if I didn't recently learn what resting bitch face meant. 
<laughs> it's easy for those around him to mistake him for a jerk. He's always by himself, too. Maybe that's why he's so nice to me. That's so sad. Uh-oh, I almost forgot. I need to give you that paperwork, Ryota. I'll show you to the do I'll show you to the dorms. They're really close by. That guy. He's always by himself? Someone that kind and that cool? Uh-oh. <clears throat> well, here's the room. Right here. I'll get that paperwork. Huh? The door's unlocked. Maybe Krampus is in? Krampus, are you here? Do you hear that? Yeah! That's en That's enough, fried chicken man! Who are you? Tell me your names! We typically don't share our names with villains, but we'll make an exception for you. We'll make an exception for you! <laughs> Blessed by the star named Soul, fighting evil around the world, the envoys of justice! Blessed by the star named Soul, fighting evil around the world, the envoys of justice! Blue Sky Ranger! Sun Ranger! <laughs> Ah, <laughs> uh, Krampus. The door was unlocked, so we came in. Die! Huh? K Krampus? D d die! Ah, he looks bad. He's attacking! Oh no, we spooked him. We have to calm him down somehow. It's hard to blame him for attacking us when we just caught him in such an embarrassing scenario. Don't call it embarrassing! Ah! <laughs> oh god. <laughs> and that's episode one. <laughs> that's episode one. <laughs> uh.